out of this place of birth And I know it cannot last But at last I can finally breathe And I know Hey guys, it's Christina and you are here with another tutorial. Today I will be showing you guys how to do the splits on the floor. I also have other tutorials. All the links will be down in the description below if you want to check those out. Let's get started! Before actually going into our splits and starting to stretch there, we will first warm up muscles a little. First, you will go into a pike-like position on the floor and you will go forward pointing and flexing your feet, going as much as possible. Then bend of your one legs under you and then go forward. Keep going forward until you feel warm in that leg. You can stay there for a minute or more, it really depends on you. Switch your legs and do the same thing to your other leg. Now repeat the process once again. You don't only have to repeat it once, you can repeat it as many times as possible until you feel ready. Switch your legs. Now bring your legs together and go forward. You can also flex your feet for a deeper stretch. For the first exercise, we will be on our knees, we will straighten one leg out and just bend forward. You can also flex your foot for a deeper stretch. Stay there for a while and then switch your legs. Repeat the process once again. Do this exercise until you feel ready to do the following exercises. Now you will be going into a split like position, but your front leg will be bent and your foot will be on the floor. This position stretches out your back leg and your back hip. Try to keep your foot that is in front of you right below your knee. Then bend your back leg. Stay there for a really long time, really feeling the stretch in the back leg. Keep repeating the process and then when you feel ready, you will lift your arms up and just stay there. Slowly get out of the position and do the same thing to the other leg.
Try to keep your back leg as straight as possible. Once again, stay in there for a pretty long time for you to feel the stretch. Occasionally bending your back leg for even a more stretch. Now lift your arms up when you feel ready and stay there for quite a long time. Slowly get out. Now you will be sitting on your knees but your feet will be out a little so your legs will be on the side of you and you will go back. Now we will stretch our pike once again. When you stretch your pike, go back on your knees and straight your leg, go down, and then bend your leg and go into that position. Straight your leg and then bend your leg while bending your back leg, stretching. Do this about 20 times. Repeat the process to the other leg. Remember not to go too fast or you will lose your balance. Now for this exercise, we will actually be trying to go into our splits. So as you see, at first it'll be a little hard and you will not be touching the floor. For some people, it'll take more than a day to get the splits on the floor. It really depends on how much you know and how flexible your muscles are. For some people, it'll be much quicker than one day. Do the same thing to the other leg. Also remember that one of your legs will always be better than another. So try to keep the bad leg stretching even more than the good leg to keep them even. Now for the next exercise, you will be stretching out your back hip. You will straighten your back leg, but keep your front leg bent. And slowly go down and straighten your front leg. After this exercise, you will be sitting on the floor. Stay in that position for as long as possible. Slowly get out and do the same thing to the other leg. Once again, stay as long as possible as you can in that leg. Slowly get out. 
Now you see me here in my right split and I am just sitting in the split, stretching it and sitting there as long as possible. You can go forward if you want. You can bend your back leg for even a more stretch. All these exercises will help with your splits. Do the same thing to the left leg. You can go forward and you can also bend your back leg. To help your right and left splits, you can also stretch your middle splits. The middle splits will open the hips up and it will help you with your splits. Once again, staying in your middle splits as long as possible. If you do not know how to get your middle splits and you want to learn, go check out my tutorial. The link will be down in the description below. It is how to get your middle splits for beginners. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys like this video, please give it a like and subscribe. I will be doing more tutorials for you guys. If you guys have any requests, comment them down below and I'll be happy to post a video on it. It can be tutorials or it could be just normal videos, examples like challenges or other videos. I'll see you guys next time. Bye!